community is mourning the loss of a beloved football coach. He died after complications from a stomach cancer surgery. Joe Technic was diagnosed just a month ago and was determined to beat that cancer. Well, Natalie Pozo with News Radio 1067 spoke with people at Eagles Landing High School who say he was an amazing man, both on and off the field. The void that we have is so tremendous. It's just because he gave us all so much. A family is mourning the loss of a man they say never met a stranger. Eagles Landing High School football coach Joe Technip was given the green light to go home after a grueling surgery for cancer. But on his 19-year-old daughter's birthday and just one day before his wedding anniversary, he died. The unique thing about Joe is that his family extended you know, beyond his immediate family and it was pretty much wherever, whoever he would come in contact with, he always wanted to make everybody better. The 47-year-old coach led his team to the playoffs two years in a row, the furthest the team has gone in the school's history. But those who knew him say the team made it because of what the coach taught off the field. A lot of football coaches are about winning football games, but Joe was about academics and character and building men before winning football games. And because he was about that, his success followed him. Preparation, confidence, and character. And he embodied that every day. Coach Technip implemented a character building program at the school because he wanted to make sure the students had the proper tools as they moved on in life. Joel Harris knew Coach Technip for more than 10 years and is the announcer at the football games. He says he will truly miss seeing his friend when looking onto the field next season. Definitely a presence on the field. Um, it, it will be different not to see him there. and they, and. Before the games, the things he would do to uh, just be there for the, the guys as they prepared for, for game time. Coach Technip leaves behind a wife and son who plays football at Georgia Tech and a daughter who runs track and field at the University of West Georgia. Hundreds of students and staff made their way onto the football field Sunday to remember the man they say had an impact on the entire community. He, he, he has influenced us, influenced us all and, and we will all be better people because of our association with him. And the memorial service for Coach Technip will be held tomorrow at 6 o'clock at St. James the Apostle Catholic Church in McDonough. In Henry County, Nathalie Pozo, News Radio 1067 for Fox 5 News. And it appears he will be missed.